Hey guys, it's Cryptomio Analysis coming at you with an update video on Benki. So this is for 17 Porsche 17. <clears throat> I have a lot of comments I actually need to reply to, so I'm gonna get to the videos right now. Um, and yeah, let's get right into it. So <clears throat> nothing really going on with Benki actually, nothing that I see. However, let's look into it, see where the TA is and yeah, so. Soccer RSI needs to reset. RSI is looking good, but you can clearly see we are stuck in this channel, right? Yeah. So it's still not bullish. Let me see if it actually came back down to. Yeah. So we actually broke the three, uh, two, three, six, but we might get rejected. So just be aware of that. Okay. Now, once it gets a, once it pumps to the three, eight, two at around 17, uh, theoretically, that's really bullish because we are going to break this channel. So that's going to actually break this channel and it's going to put it at, you can clearly see, it's going to put it over. So we can get something like this where uh, it breaks out and then as long as it stays over the 236, not only are we uh, above this channel, but we're going to start moving back up. So uh, the targets to break, the targets to beat will be uh needs to stay over 14 and 17 needs to break. Otherwise expect a uh, another move down. And when we do move down, unfortunately the next target is gonna be the 786, which is gonna make a lower, uh, lower low. So you can see we almost tagged it, but we didn't. So this is very crucial. So obviously we're stuck in resistance at this point, right? So <clears throat> again, 14 to 17 is resistance, which we're experiencing resistance right now. And then the next area of support is nine. Okay, so adding a 0 0.98, so around one cent. Uh, at any point, once we break 17, uh, I say to the moon, we're gonna basically retest this high and then probably explode from there. However, if that doesn't happen, then we're gonna get stuck in this downward channel and the next target is one cent. And if that happens, then I will make another update video at that time because someone will probably ask me to. So. Just be aware of that. I wouldn't buy right now. Again, we, you know, from this dip, we are like Ben Key's up 48%. So it probably does need to cool off. Um, but regardless, if it pops, if it doesn't get over 17, we are gonna come back down. So uh, keep that in mind. I hope this all makes sense. Please like, subscribe, comment. I mean, it's not, it's not that it's doing bad. I just want, I, I just wanna emphasize the fact that we are stuck. We are literally in resistance. We're in that box. So just don't get overly bullish because you're probably, like if it comes back down, you're gonna be, it's gonna kill your morale, right? That's happened to me before. So once it gets over 17, then that's when you're like, oh wow, like I'm, this is great. Like at that point, whoever bought the dip would be up, you know, 72% and it potential 288% from that dip. So uh, I hope that happens for you guys, but until then we'll just monitor it and take it from there. Please like, subscribe, uh, please like, subscribe, comment. Thank you so much for your support. I'll catch you guys in the next video.